The I team tonight with a crucial reminder to look closely at your home assessment report for errors. A suburban homeowner says she's paying more in taxes than her neighbors, even though they have virtually the same homes. Consumer investigator Jason Knowles has been covering property tax problems for years. He's with us in this new story tonight, Jason. Rob, Judy, what if you were being assessed for the wrong home and being told it had more square footage than it actually does? One woman says that the Cook County Assessor's Office made the square footage error, all of it, the homeowner says, costing her thousands of dollars in extra taxes. Soon after moving into her new South Barrington gated community in 2017, Sherry Schnell realized that homes which were the same model and about the same size as hers had lower assessments and that even some larger homes had lower assessments. In talking with my neighbors, I found out our taxes were the highest compared to everybody else. Schnell thinks she's paid thousands of dollars in extra taxes through the years for square footage she doesn't have. She tried to have it corrected with the Cook County Assessor with no luck. We've overpaid all these years. We're still overpaying. Schnell turned to the Barrington Township you know, Deputy Assessor, I, Sue Johnston, like said, who I'm advocates for consumers. She's filed so many appeals uh, for certificate of error a board of review, and we keep getting turned down. They just can't recognize that I have the wrong square footage. Johnston agrees, saying that the Cook County Assessor's records inaccurately state that Schnell has nearly 300 more square feet in her home. And get this, the Barrington Township Assessor says that Cook County assessed her for the wrong style home, a model which is more expensive. I sent the county the drawing that I did for the house let them know that they had the wrong parcel on her property, sent them the closing documents, sent them all of their documents showing what model they had. The Cook County Assessor's Office eventually confirmed that their information is wrong in this email saying our system now shows the correct square footage. I would love for them to refund the money that we overpaid for all these years. But then the Cook County Assessor's Office said her assessment and bills won't change. In this email, the Cook County Assessor's Office stated our valuations team has determined that the reduction in square footage is not not great enough to result in a reduction in valuation. The Barrington Township Assessor disagrees, saying when you add up the higher square footage and account for the fact that Schnell's home was not one of the higher tiered models as assessed, that she overpaid between $600 and $1,000 a year since 2018. That could add up to around $5,000 or more, which Schnell is owed. It's a lot of money. It, it is. You know, and... And that, that's why she's fighting so hard. And that's why I physically went out and measured it. Johnston also made this list of more than 100 other similar models as Schnell's. It shows that she's somehow assessed the highest of them all. They have her at the value that they did of that larger home. The I-team reached out to the Cook County Assessor's Office and it said it's continuing to research this case and will work with both the township assessor and taxpayer to ensure that the property characteristics are correct and to check whether an assessment reduction may be warranted for prior years. As part of that research, we will also examine whether the characteristics of other homes in the area may be affected by a similar issue. I don't know what else to do. The Cook County Assessor's Office says it has not conducted an in-person field inspection on the home in question since 2018. As the I-Team has reported, there has not been a full in-person field evaluation for all of Cook County's nearly 2 million properties since 1997. But Rob, Judy, the Assessor's Office says it does conduct inspections and uses software to evaluate property values. But what a story this woman so persistent to try to prove what she believes is right and she's telling her story. And there's us. no shortage of documents. Right. She has it all. It's all right there. Okay. We'll see what happens. Nice okay, work, Jason, Jason, thanks. Yeah. We're expecting temperatures to